normally on the end of the lead screw there's this hub which that silver steel pin locates in tighten the grub screw up and that's it drives the lead screw once all the other gears are on obviously and then so what I'm doing because ML7 gears are so much easier to get hold of I'm having a key slot machined in the end of the lead screw so I can put they're all the same diameter um, same thickness same diameter hole in the middle so just should, should make things a lot easier to get different change wheels if I need them and although this may seem a bit out of place on a 90 year old machine the micrometer lead screw um, will set me back about 120 quid but even with one of those the nut has to be good on the thread otherwise you're working with sums and things in your head to take out the backlash but with this this cost me about eight quid from Aldi and it only measures the movement not the backlash I reckon I'm going to cut these bits off here so that I can go all the way through if I need to but here we are getting there might as well cut that end off there and all I suppose <laughs> 